Pex pipe or uh, or Pex pipe? Which is the difference? This is the issue that a lot of people have, and even some plumbers are confused of which type of pex, pex pipe. The most used types of pex pipe is going to be the Ubinor that is used with the red tool there that you see and the one to the left is going to use the Zern uh, pex pipe. There are two different pex pipes but they are pex pipes. One's expandable and one's not. The tool here that you're looking at to the right is going to be made for Zern pex pipe and what makes this popular especially down in Houston they run a lot of this Zern PEX pipe is the cost the cost of the tools it, it's a lot cheaper than the uh, Ubinor uh, tool and the fittings are ready available at Home Depot or Lowe's which the uh, Ubinor you're not gonna walk into any of those stores and just pick those um, fittings right up you're gonna have to normally go to a plumbing supply house this is a copper fitting with copper rings what they call it and it crimps over the pipe itself and this is a Zern fitting uh, one thing you'll notice the Zern fitting the inside diameter is smaller than the outs the in inside diameter of the Ubinor which uh, if you're running um, Zern you may have some inspectors that may frown upon that because it's not the true size of uh, what the piping should be and again you can get this tool at Lowe's or Home Depot and it's a reasonable price um, I think at the time I got this one was like 80 bucks or something like that and that's been a while Now, you're looking at the Ubinor. This is the Ubinor. And this is what they use. They use these little print rings. And what you do is you slide the print ring over the pipe, which I'll show you throughout the video. You slide it over the pipe, and they use a tool that expands the plastic, uh, the uh, PEX tubing, and expand it to where it opens up and goes around the fitting. And once it's around there and you let it go, it... Uh, goes back to its original form and it has a nice tight seal. 